There was once an ancient line of action figures who created a magical power source that would allow humans to keep their favorite childhood memories of their toys. This ancient power source is known as the Hypercore. Today, these tiny devices are hidden throughout kids' rooms all around the world. A young boy and his older brother were gifted two action figures. Yippee! Max Ammo and a special edition figure, Max Damage. The young boy played many hours with Max Ammo and loved him as a toy. But his older brother kept the Max Damage special edition in the box as a collector's item. This caused Max Damage to feel alone and unloved, waiting for the day he would also be played with. Max Damage became envious of Max Ammo. He devised a plan, a way to relinquish the memories of the boy by wiping out all hypercores. Alas, his plan didn't turn out how he had hoped. When trying to destroy the first hypercore, he was struck by a surge of power. The process corrupted Max Damage, turning him dark and twisted. He then took on a new moniker, Major Evil. <laughs> Max Ammo and his defense corps made it their duty to protect the hypercores. Increasingly hungry for more energy, Major Evil used his new powers to gain control over other toys, who became his minions. And so the first hyper war began and escalated quickly between Max Ammo and Major Evil. But it all came to an end when Max Ammo unhinged Major Evil, making him a non-refundable toy. The war was won, and Major Evil wasn't to be seen again. Many peaceful years have passed. Now Max Ammo can finally look forward to his retirement. I have to admit, sir, I've been dreaming of fighting by your side. I'm fresh out of the box and ready for some action. <laughs> well, when you've fought as long as I have, you come to cherish the quiet moments. <laughs> hey there, Slobby! Uh, sir? Wait a minute. Was that a Slobkin? There's only one toy who can control Slobkins. I have a terrible suspicion that there's evil afoot. <laughs> Looks like you'll get your chance, soldier. What are you doing, soldier? We're under attack! An enemy army is on its way and we have to inform all outposts! Our owner's strict, if it's yellow, let it mellow policy is driving me crazy. I have to flush it. I can't take it anymore. Blow dry your hinges. These spinners are unpredictable. <sighs> oh. 
Life Guardian, what's your current intel on the enemy forces? From here, we should be able to stop the invasion at the route. I'm just not sure where to find the toy weaponry. Hey! Oi, lad. Are you protecting this area? <laughs> well, take this as a yes. Give him a weapon. The pleb, Sergeant? We need all the firepower we can get. Uh, okay. <laughs> Maybe this was a bad idea. Max Ammo. Did any of you see anything strange these past days? Aside from an old cyborg skulking about, not really. Hmm, sounds like major evil to me. We need to defend the Hypercore. Enemy toys are on their way and we don't have a lot of time. That ruined my perfect armor? I don't think so. Don't worry, old man. Nothing will happen. And even if it does, You'll be protected. I swear it on my honor as Valkyrie. Incoming! Let's do this. Now, light these mean greens up. of the local arcade. You guys have to hold it off until backup arrives. Okay, how many are there? And how do we know when they're coming? Um, just a few. It'll be mostly spinners. You'll hear a strange buzzing. If the buzz intensifies, you'll know they're close. Oh, that's very comforting to hear. Hello? Do you hear that? Just a few, eh? Did you hear about one of Max Ammo's guys? He spotted some alien activity. Get out of here. What kind of alien activity? UFOs. They even abducted one of our soldiers. <laughs> <laughs> it's the truth. One minute he was here, the next he was gone. Are you talking about that soldier who deserted? That's a poor excuse. What is happening? I've changed my mind. It's a pretty good excuse. Man, I'm so bored with this attic. Why does Max Ammo send us these grimy outposts anyways? This place will never be attacked. But we can never be too careful. You never know what's lurking round the corner. Oh, you're just saying that because you're scared of the dark. I'll go patrol sector B. Oh, wait for me! Why is the hypercore damaged? Did you hit it during target practice? Do you really think I'd be up here by myself? I've never fired a single shot up here. Man, 
I'm sick of pepperoni pizza. Why can't we ever have pineapple? If Sergeant Max Ammo heard you say that, you'd be put back in your box. Or would you rather be sent to the garage? Can we at least open a window? Uh, why? Because the last time you made pizza, the whole kitchen smelled like burnt pepperoni and cheese. But it still tasted good. Am I right? Yeah, whatever. I'm opening it. <clears throat> well, just be careful. The last time we opened a window... The last time what? Tell me. I don't remember anything happening. or not, I'm still gonna finish my pizza. Can't always be right. Clearing the toy store wasn't easy, and we still have to make sure there are no potential threats left in this place. I guess somebody must have been altering these over here ages ago. <laughs> Bingo! Well, well. There ain't nothing many about this gun. Sir? Step aside! All clear. Oh, we're not done here yet. Something big is coming. Clara has reported that a bouncy hall infestation is occurring somewhere behind this house. The shed needs to be searched. No initial signs of bouncy balls here! <laughs> Only one more shelf left! <laughs> That's no infestation! Let me handle this! Okay, I've got this one. You guys handle the rest. Probably too late for traps, isn't it? Listen up, toy soldiers. We've contained the attacks of Major Evil around the house and the toy store. Let's push him back while he's getting weaker. You mean getting stronger? You might have damaged some toys, but he won't hold me back. You're still no match for the Defense Corps. Defense Corps? Your lot of peg warmers should have been discontinued a long time ago. There's a special someone I'd like you to meet. I would love to stay and chat, but there's another party I have to plan. I think we need to get some anti-air. I know this area like the back of me hand, but I can't see anything. Me either. I can't see shh. Let's go radio silent, soldiers. I feel danger is near. Guys, I see something. Ah, yes, I knew it. Finally, there's an exit. This is not an exit. This is a gate. This was a trap! Fall in! Eyes front! This is one of the last outposts. We're getting closer to Major Evil's lair. I can feel it. All aboard, mateys! Yo-ho-ho ho, and a bottle of rum! 
Can someone tell me why he's talking like that? Any more lip from here, and I'll tow you to the mast. Sorry, Sergeant. Ever since he took responsibility for this sector, he's gone a little too into the whole pirate thing. <laughs> as long as he keeps the enemy from the sector, he can be an astronaut for all I care. See me a fine ship, and I'll be darned if she's taken from us. Go out, build, and protect. Join me in the great battle. I think I'm starting to like this guy. I never took you as the lock-picking type, Sarge. Uh, unfortunately, I'm not. Mm, this ain't going to work. I might have an idea. Oh, my head. Soldiers, do the words breaking and entering mean anything to you? What are we actually doing here? Isn't this an adult's room? Trust me, I know the tenant well, and something tells me that Major Evil is close. Let's build some defenses. Ah, how things change. You might sell for a pretty penny on a garage sale. It's over, Major Evil. Surrender. Why should I? Give me your hand. Here. <laughs> I think he got the hand thing wrong. Don't worry. He's in Sir Ferdinand's territory. Good boy. I can't watch this. It looks like Major Evil found someone who'll play with him after all. And so, once again, Max Ammo has bested Major Evil and his minions to protect the hypercores from all evil. But be vigilant, for there may be other toys who seek its incredible power.